this video, we will continue with Introduction to Vectors. You will find this on page 223 in the Namibia AS Level Mathematics Textbook Y equals MX plus C to success. Let's look at example 2. The figure shows a cube of sides 4 units with the origin at its center. Very important. And the X, Y and Z axis parallel to the three edges. Write down the coordinates of all eight vertices of the cube. Okay, remember it's in the center. So that means it's two to that side, two to that side, two up, two down. Okay, maybe I can just give you this list to say to you, remember, and I'm going to write it later on again. I will just clean it. If you go to the right, Okay, this is the X. If you go to the right, it's positive. If you go to the left, it's negative. Okay, this is the Y. If you go to the back, it's positive. If you come to the front, if you come out, it's going to be negative. And the Z. If you go up, it's positive. Oh, let's just get the pin correct. If you go up, it's positive. And if you go down, correct, sorry. If you go down, it's negative. Okay, so this is positive, positive, positive. This is negative, negative, negative. Okay, so keep that in mind. Okay, but let's start. Remember, it's in the middle, so it's 2. So, if I look at A, where is A? There. Now, can you see, first the X, I'm going to the left, that's why it's negative 2. And then, okay, I go, first I'm coming to the front, that's why it's negative t again. But then I go up, and that's why it's positive. Okay, let's look at B, where is B? Now, again, I go to the left. So that's why it's negative. Then I go to the back. That's positive. Positive. And then I go up. Do you see? And if I go up, it's also positive. Okay. And then if I look at the next one, number C. Okay. If I, if I go to the right, it's positive. If I go to the back, it's positive. So right, positive, and up positive so i'm doing all the positive things and then if i look at number d okay again it's to the right that's why it's positive okay and then it's going to be to the front that's why it's negative and then up and that's why it's positive positive. and then if i look at number e okay again i go to the left that's why it's negative and then I go, um, okay, this is number E, and then I come to the front, that's why it's negative, and I go down and it's negative. So I do all the, this. Then F, where is F? There. Okay, so if, if I'm going to the first one, I'm going to the left, it's negative, okay? And then I go to the back, okay, where is F? F, yes. Now, I go to the left, and then, after that, I'm, okay, I'm going to the back, and that's positive, do you see? And then I go down, and that's negative. And then number G, I just want to get another paper color. Okay, I go to the right, and that's positive. Then I go to the back, and that's positive. And then I go down, and that's negative. There you see that. And then the last one, number H. Okay, let's think again. I go to the right, so it's positive. And then I, go, I come to the front, and that's why it's negative. And I go down, and that's why it's negative. So I think if you memorize this, then, then, then it will make it a little bit easier. Okay, I want you to stop the video, and I want you to do try now to number one. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. 
it's more or less the same. Um, so the figure shows a cube of six units now. So now write down the origin and its center. Okay, and it's again in the center. And I'm just going to write down all. So all the values, write down the coordinates of all eight vertices of the cube. Okay. So let's start with number one. Uh, I'm going to, and again I'm going to mark it, so P. I'm going to start with P. So again, remember, now it's just free. Every time it's free, 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 all is free. Okay, so it's going to that side, so that's why it's negative three. And, and it's, I'm working from the center, so it's negative three. And now it's coming to me, so that's why it's also negative three. Okay, and then, is, um, did I start with P? But then I go up, and that's why it's positive. Okay. And then I go to Q. Okay, now think of Q. You are in the center. So go negative 3. Okay. And then go to the back, so it's free, not to the front, to the back, and then up, positive P. And then R. It is R. Okay, now positive 3 is level right, it's actually right, positive 3. And then uh, you go to the back, so it's again positive 3, and you go up, positive 3. And then the last one is of the top. Okay, so again positive 3, do you agree? And then you are coming to me, to the front, so that will always be negative 3. But then you go up. That's again positive P. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Uh, T. Okay, I'm standing there, so it's negative 3. Okay, and then it's to me, so it's again negative 3. And then it's down, and it's negative. Okay, so T, U. Okay, so there I'm standing, so again negative 3. Then I go to the back, that's positive 3. And then I go down, and that's again negative. And then V, V. Okay, so again, first always left or right, to the right, so positive 3. Okay, and then, then I go to the back, so it's again positive 3. And then I go down, and that's why it's negative 3. So it's, it's almost like you can summarize it. If it's to the left, it's a negative. If it's to the right, it's a positive. Okay, and that is for my x. And then for my y, if it's uh, to, to me, to the front, okay, then it's negative. If it's to the back, it's positive. Okay, and then z, if it's up, it's positive. And if it's down, it's negative. Okay. So, okay, let's see if we can follow this now for this last one, V. Um, okay. And so, that was V. Did I have correct? Okay, let's do the W. Okay. So, let's see. I'm going first to the what? To the right. So, that's why it's positive 3. Okay. Then... I'm coming to the front, that's why it's negative 3. And then I go down, and that's why it's negative. So you can even memorize it by memorizing the, the small table.